Hello and welcome to Advanced Camping and RVs virtual tour of this 2017 CS Adventurous Road Trek. This is in the uh, Champagne Pearl exterior. Really nice looking, very reflective surface. A really nice uh, touch to this one. Really looks uh, really beautiful. Champagne Pearl. And we'll have our power awning on the roof there. And we'll have the side screens on this model. We'll also have the uh, 470 watt solar panel system on here. So an upgraded solar panel system. Uh, it of course has the underhood generator and volt start to automatically start that engine. And we'll have uh, our AGM batteries to power the whole coach, uh, potentially for hours, depending on what you're using. So, coming into the front here, we'll see all the latest Mercedes features. Uh, we'll have heated seats for both of our front uh, leather seats here. We will have blind spot assist, lane keeping assist which is going to be on our mirrors there. Uh, we will also have a heated windshield. We'll have um, you know the brighter bi-xenon headlamps for the front. Uh, we'll have a pixel matrix display in the center here, which will give us uh, our latest up-to-date information on our Mercedes machine. We'll be able to uh, Bluetooth with our phone in the center and use that as a backup camera as well. Also is a wonderful GPS system, and that's the uh, Mercedes Becker navigation system built right in. To go with our CS, we'll have our larger Nurkold refrigerator that um, will give you lots of extra room compared to other Class Bs. And we'll also have our convection microwave where we can bake, we can grill, and we can microwave on here. So a really nice addition. And with the CS, it's at eye level. So really easy to just pop it open, use it anytime you need to. We'll have an extra captain seat here. Um, there is an option where you could order an additional mattress if you wanted to sleep a third person here. Otherwise, it works very well if you're carrying a passenger. This seat does swivel and recline and things like that and does have two armrests perfect up here we'll have our control panel where uh, we'll control our inverter and uh, that will basically give you 110 power anywhere and uh, say you're running the air conditioning overnight and uh, you know you wanted to continually run that without being plugged in or making any additional generator noise you just turn the volt start module on, the little switch in the front, and uh, it would automatically start the engine for about a half an hour. Uh, the idling on uh, one of these sprinter chassis is near, near complete silence, um, and that will idle give you your battery charge back, and we'll do that up to five times. So you'll completely silently recharge your batteries uh, and no one has to know that you're even in a motorhome. And your inverter makes that all possible by converting that battery power to 110 power. And we'll have various other controls here. We'll have a monitor panel to check our various uh, different levels, battery levels, propane levels, different tank levels. All nice and centrally located there. Lots of nice LED lighting throughout. Easy push button operation on these. We'll have the uh, in sync uh, instant hot water heater system. So, uh, as much hot water as you want for brewing tea, coffee, anything like that, it's instant and also gives you a filter. So, if even for colder water, um, if you wanted to use it for drinking, It'd be real easy just to turn the cold uh, spigot on and you can get nice filtered cool water. And we'll have our regular uh, recessed sink under here 
and that will be controlled by the Aldi system. And uh, the Aldi system will give you the in-floor heat, which was what the CS model comes with. You'll have the in-floor heat, true in-floor heat, unlike, um, you know, we'll have a diesel Aldi system, which is what's on the e-track. On the CS, what comes standard is the in-floor heat version. And um, you'll actually get true radiant heat from this, and we'll give you a completely silent uh, running operation. It'll be completely silent when you turn the heat on. Okay, and we've got our two burner stove here with an automatic ignition. Makes that nice and easy. Just automatically spark like so. And open up our bathroom here. There'll be a, a nice radiator here that's waterproofed. So you can shower, and if some gets in there, that's totally fine. Uh, but we have a decent area to shower here, real nice and big, very tall. Um, we'll have a rocker switch here for waterproof lighting. And we will have our toilet right there, which goes right into our black tank, uh, which then uh, goes through a macerator pump, which makes that a whole lot easier. You can pump that out either on an incline or a decline, unlike a gravity feed system, uh, where you have to be totally level. This one will pump it out wherever you happen to be, giving you even more freedom. We'll see some magazine racks on the outside here. There's even a little travel lock here, so when we are traveling, we can engage that so things don't rock around like so lots of little uh drawers all throughout road track really does a nice job of that in the cs they add an additional closet here too which can be used for hanging clothes storage and you can remove these shelves or a shelved storage as it's shown here you get this extra um, closet as it actually holds the uh, antifreeze, the glycol mixture, for the Aldi system. So, in the essence, you're getting an extra closet on the CS that you wouldn't get on the e trek or RS Adventurous. Okay, and we'll have our power sofa in the rear here. There's going to be a lot of nice memory foam underneath there. Really comfortable to sleep on. Really easy to put down into a bed. I'm just pushing a button right here. We can stuff those. Um, we can stuff those seat belts right down. Won't be a problem. And then we can either choose to leave this open. If you need to use a restroom in the middle of the night, that's a great uh, way to do that. Just leave that open. Or you can fill that in and make a total uh, king size bed. We can slide this over. Basically our wooden piece here, slide it over. Put our back two cushions right over top of it. And we'll have a full king size bed. All these system will be right back here. We'll be able to control that. Um, our three different uh, sources of power for it are going to be propane, electricity, and we also have the option on the CS to uh, run a heat exchanger from the engine, which makes uh, basically the engine heat heat your coach and your hot water, which is a really nice addition to the CS lineup. Over here, we will have uh, an LG Blu-ray player so we can actually stream, you know, Netflix, Hulu, it is a smart player. Um, it works well with our 24-inch LED TV that does come with it. We've removed ours for safety reasons. And we'll have a new touchscreen Dometic thermostat in here for the air conditioner and fan. That's kind of neat. That's a brand new one for 2017. The old ones um, 
were uh, just a little different and this one's just a little sharper, more modern looking and um, has a nice blue LED display. Okay, and we'll have our back screen here as well. So when these back two doors open, this will all be screened off very nicely. And the side screen as well, if you decide to put that in, um, that's going to work perfectly if you don't want to run air conditioning. As we'll have our remote controlled fantastic fan here. You can even set that to any kind of temperature you want to set it to. And it'll turn on and off as needed. There is a rain sensor as well on it, so uh, feel free to leave that on. And if it does start to rain, it'll just close itself right up. And that is all remote controlled. Really perfect for when you have those two screens out or, you know, it's a pretty mild night and you want some airflow. It does a really, really great job. And we'll have uh, day-night shades throughout as well. These are really easy to sort of pull up and, you know, during the day you'll have this nice pleated cloth. At night it sort of blacks everything out various studio lighting and things like that throughout the coach, various 12 volt outlets, cigarette uh, lighter style outlets throughout, mixed in with 110 outlets. We'll have a full surround sound system in here as well, complete with a subwoofer for excellent sound. And going through the coach here, Plenty of aisleway height, plenty of headroom. That's really what makes it nice. And, um, you know, of course, the signature for the Mercedes is just big, big panoramic views. Um, you get a lot of glass in front of you when you're sitting up in the front here. So, that's going to be particularly nice on the Mercedes. We'll come out on our power step here. Take a little walk around. We'll have um, chrome accents on our champagne exterior. Dual wheels, of course. There's even a wind guidance computer built into this Mercedes. So uh, when you're getting sort of buffeted by wind on the freeway, it will compensate for that. And it will give you a much straighter ride while going down the road. The dual wheels certainly help with that as well. But with the addition of the wind guidance computer with the Mercedes, it really gives you a true straight ride, even in heavy wind conditions or bad storms. You can see a little bit of storage back here. And, um, you know, we'll see our 30 amp shore power cord right there. We'll have our seat belts and everything under here. And really what I'm trying to get at is there is some basement storage. Here we are. There's some basement storage underneath there as well. That might even be a better place for our 30 amp uh, cord to go. Or other little uh, utilities such as water hoses or really anything you can think of. Tools maybe. Woofer over there back in the corner our inverter right there and then the rest will be all storage and remember we can uh, put our screen on and once we do we can fully extend these doors pushing this out a bit there's a magnetic latch on the outside that it'll stick on to you can even fold that in right there. You can do that on both sides and really have a very open sort of patio area in the back. In the back here as well, we'll have our hitching and wiring. Perfect for towing any kind of trailer. Uh, it does have all the pre-wiring for our brake control setup as well. This one will tow around 5,000 pounds. 
with the uh, six cylinder, three liter Mercedes Benz turbo diesel. Okay. We'll have an outside shower. We'll have easy access for that right on the outside. It, they kind of camouflage it nicely into the side of the stass. It's not real obvious. We'll have the uh, output for the hot water heater and heat system all in one small round port here for the Aldi system. That's much lower profile than uh, other hot water heater and heat uh, combos. We'll have magnetic door latches and hinges here. That'll be for your plug-in here. Um, looks like your spare tire down there as well. Over here, we will have uh, the propane system, city water connection, and we'll also have our macerator pump. This is nice, it's easily retractable, and just pull it right out like so. The other end goes into the ground, and they do make a, uh, an adapter that comes with it, so that'll fit in any normal dump site. So you can stick that end into the ground, and open up your door here, driver's side door, and there'll be a red button, and you'll push that button, and whether an incline or decline, you'll always pump all of that waste out for your gray and black water tanks. So, if it was a really cold day, it was a really hot day, you could uh, come out here and easily dump that waste. Okay, um diesel fuel is going to be right in here. This can only be accessed when this door is fully closed or fully open I'm sorry. When it's fully closed and it's locked you won't be able to uh, access the fuel compartment so you won't have that to worry about. But all in all just a really nice looking 2017 CS Adventurous um, Really gorgeous. Uh, I really like the champagne exterior. Really one of the sharpest exteriors they have in my opinion. This one really has all the bells and whistles too. Of course the six year unlimited mile warranty is huge. No one else in the industry has anything like that. I mean Winnebago or com competition will have a one year warranty on these. So uh, you know it says something that road trucks is going to do you, you know, six years. No, you know, it doesn't matter how many miles are on it, uh, and we can do all that work right here in house. Or, um, you know, if you're not local, we can find you a road track dealer that would be close. So, as always, thanks for watching our YouTube uh, videos, and you can always subscribe to our channel on YouTube. Um, you can visit us at advancedcamping.com. We always love to hear from you. Or give us a call at 414-281-6330. Thank you and have a great day.